I want to end by settling an argument in front of all of you that Jad and I have been bickering over for many years. She'll often say that I love you, to which I'll respond, I love you more. Then she'll disagree and we'll go back and forth to no end. But after today, I think I can finally explain to her what I mean when I say it. So Jad, when I say I love you more, I don't mean I love you more than you love me. I mean I love you more than the bad days ahead of us. I love you more than any fight we will ever have. I love you more than any amount of distance keeping us apart. And I love you more than any obstacle that would try to come between us. I love you more than anything. So from now on, know that when I say I love you, I don't just say it out of habit. I say it as a reminder to you of this day, those promises, and you're the best goddamn thing that's ever happened to me. My darling wife, I adore you. Someone asked me once, how do you know you were in love? And I thought about it for a while. I used to be terrified at the thought of getting older. It seems like everything seemingly gets worse. But as soon as you entered my life, suddenly getting older seemed so exciting. It dawned on me that I'm so in love with you that I quite literally cannot wait to grow old with you. Although you were not ready for a relationship when we first met, I still knew what our future held and I felt something special. I saw marriage from the beginning, as weird as that may sound. <laughs> I knew I was going to do this for the long run, no matter where I ended up attending college to pursue my sports career. We made it six years long distance seeing each other once or twice every month. That means so much to so. me. Not only have I been in a relationship with you these last eight years, but also your family. They've welcomed me with open arms, and although I am from a different culture than you, it made me fall in love with you even more. Evelyn, I promise to be there with you through health and through sickness. I realize that a relationship is not always rainbows and butterflies, and that the greatest love comes with fighting through whatever struggles we may face. I promise that I will always stay patient and work with you through whatever may come in our way, as patience has been key to our relationship. I promise to keep honor honoring your cultural values, and to always be there for you through any hate or discrimination that may come your way because of who you are and where you came from. I promise to be there when, it's your, when you are at your best times and in your worst. I promise to stay with you till the end of, of time in our world. Doy gracias a Dios por ti todos los días. Realmente me ha dado a alguien muy especial. Siempre seré tu gringo, pase lo que pase. <laughs> Brett, there's no one in the world I'd rather live life alongside. And I choose you as my partner to navigate the challenges, plan our strategies, and celebrate our triumphs. I love you so much, and I'm proud to call you my husband. Thank you for choosing me as a partner. A lot of here, people here know parts of me, but you truly know all of me. Understand me, love me, and inspire me daily to be my best self. I love you, and I can't wait to show you the rest, for the rest of my life how much I do. Does anybody need a tissue? <laughs> <laughs> I promised you I'd take about three things in my life seriously. This will be one. Here goes. Now, when you first met me, I was lost, and I didn't know. Didn't know who I was or what I wanted. But talk to you was like finding a campfire in total darkness. I felt your warmth and light that is you. As the sun is rising, I feel like the darkness won't ever return with you by my side. You make me feel whole. It's impossible to put into words how much I love you, especially for me. You're my best friend. Snack partner, movie buddy, and the only person I need to have a party. <laughs> Writing these vows is the, one of the hardest things I've ever done. Only because I want to explain to you so badly all the love I have for you. I just kept writing down I love you over and over until something <laughs> made sense. <laughs> falling for you wasn't falling at all. 
It was walking into a house and knowing your home. I love you.